trying to solve a stunning mystery on Mobile Bay. An Orange Beach charter boat captain spotted hundreds of dead fish around the mouth of Mobile Bay on Sunday. Chad Petrie tells us what may have caused it. It's a scary sight, especially for somebody who makes their living on the water. This is video captured by Captain Blake Michaleski Sunday near the Sand Island Lighthouse. One after the other, dead red drums following a tide line in the bay. Michael Esky's video he posted on Facebook shows more than 150 in four minutes and says there were more. As someone who takes people out on the water regularly, he worried this might have been the result of runoff from heavy rains Friday or an indication of a larger problem in the bay. Yeah, you know, we put in a lot of effort for each individual fish we catch and then to see, you know, then go out there and see a few hundred dead ones. It's a little, you know, unsettling, but, you know, the, the, the striking thing was that it, there, that was the only thing affected. Officials with the Department of Natural Resources and the Dolphin Island Sea Lab are still trying to figure out what happened. Director of the School of Marine and Environmental Sciences at USA, Dr. Sean Powers, says this fish kill was likely caused by either a low oxygen event or a harmful algae bloom. Both are naturally occurring, but can also be accelerated by man-made pollution. He says they usually see a fish kill like this around once a year, but rarely this early in the season. Powers says while this video is scary, it doesn't necessarily mean there's a larger threat to the fish stock. Along Mobile Bay, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.